Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Lee and you're watching Infinite Music Reactions. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. We're continuing this Tom McDonald Stroke Mac Lethal um, diss track war. Uh, this is the Mac Lethal side of it, which is the response, obviously, to Tom, Tom McDonald's um, lethal injection. So I'm looking forward to seeing what Mac Lethal has got to say about Tom, because obviously, with a response, it's going to be dissing. Um, and I'm really, really intrigued because Tom definitely, definitely went all in on Mac Lethal on this, and I'd never heard of him. I, I, I put my hands up. I'd never heard of him. I know that he uh, started his his record label on YouTube, etc. Which why I call him a YouTuber and everything in the last video. So, you know, people are telling me he's a fast rapper. Uh, and, you know, he's, that he's really good. Uh, especially Mason on the channel. He told me he's not actually that bad. <laughs> he's done songs with like, people like Tech 9 and stuff. So, I'm intrigued. Hold on. Did I just say, din intrigued? Din intrigued? Din intrigued? <laughs> Are you tripping? I'm intrigued to see what he does now before we jump into this video then uh, please hit like and subscribe and um, the link to this video will be down in the description for anyone who wants to check it out by themselves so let's see what shots he's fired back at Tom right okay so this is uh, Mac Lethal's version of the diss back at Tom McDonald called Single White Female I am dying to see what he does here because obviously I've never seen this guy do it I don't know what he does how quick he is how brilliant he is at lyrics I'm not sure but we'll find out now anyway Let's go. I got a little story about a single white female. Her yes. name is Tammy, but you'll need some fine details. She gets up on the internet and argues with strangers because inside she's full of insecurity and anger. Okay, okay, seeing Tom McDonald's angry. angry. Well, Tammy is angry. Tammy, Tom, ta Tommy. Basically calling him a little bitch. Maybe he's addressing when Tom called him a bitch. I'm not sure. But obviously, dressing like him, putting the braids in like the, the plaits and stuff, is just one massive observational parody of Tom McDonald. <laughs> the guy's got a sense of humour. Let's go. On the internet and argues with strangers because <laughs> inside she's full of insecurity and anger. She tries to be edgy, that's her rap ploy. But okay. back in the day she was a frat boy. She says everybody hates her but no one even cares. So now I'm going to grab the bitch and throw her by the hair. Okay. Hey, you're a single white female. It's time to make the chain burn. Where's your fucking balls, bitch? You acting like you gray worm. How you going to let a little tweet hurt your feelings? Did I bruise your ego, little girl? What are you revealing? Oh. Your whole fucking gimmick is claiming everybody's too PC and sensitive. So why you want some victim shit if somebody... Oh! What? He said, why did you let... A Earlier on, he said, "Why did you let a little tweet offend you when all you do is is preach about like equality and people, um, you know, having a hard time with uh, whatever?" And then he said, "How can you be playing the victim?" Because obviously that's what he's talking about. But he's he's basically saying that Tom McDonald is contradicting himself by um, <laughs> by. Um, playing playing the victim when other people he shouts out other people for playing the victim sort of thing. That's what sort of message I'm getting from that bit. So he's saying he's contradicting himself basically. <laughs> Tom. Is claiming everybody's too PC and sensitive. So why you want some victim shit? If somebody don't like you, that shit straight troubles you. Why the fuck you acting like an SJW? You rapping like you want to make America great again, but you're not even American, Tammy. You're Canadian. You live in the <laughs> facts. Facts. Tom McDonald makes songs like America. He shouts like who hates Americans? America, uh, America, Americans and stuff like that. But he just pointed out that Tom McDonald is actually Canadian. So you know why you're preaching about it when you're not even Canadian. This is very, very clever. This is a very clever diss track, this. Make America great again, but you're not even American, Tammy. You're Canadian. Tammy. You live in the safest fucking country in the world. <laughs> yeah. And you act like you're a press man. You're such a little girl. Speaking of Oh, it, yeah, because people say that Canada's so nice. It's a nice place to be. You never get any trouble there. And then you, you're acting like you're oppressed. But you come from Canada, which is the safest place in the world. I'm uh, fucking with this. This fucking country in the world And you act like you're a press man You're such a little girl Speaking of little girls You wanna diss my daughter? Damn, that's a Ooh. cheap shot That's so damn disgusting, man Well, I can throw cheap shots, too Let's talk about the fact Your girlfriend used to suck off R.A. the Rugged Man I wanna say I'm rapping What? He's going in here He's going in proper? What? I mean, I know Tom mentioned um, Matt, Le Matt Lethal's daughter in his song But it was, it was more uh, towards the... 
stop concentrating on this and be a better parent or something like that it was and now he's gone in full fucking he's gone I can't swear because it's he's gone in full blooded and is basically saying that Nova used to <laughs> suck people off basically calling him his girlfriend a huh? <laughs> oh Oh, oh my god, I can't wait to see the Tom McDonald response to this. Talk about the fact your girlfriend used to suck off Ari the Rugged Man. <laughs> you wanna say I'm rapping filler? Your girl is a king of the dot groupie that be letting rappers filler. We got mutual oh, friends. They gave me is that guy a rapper then? Oh my god, did you No, in, in, in um, Tom's diss, he said that um, Matt Lethal, uh, yeah, you rap fast, but it's all fillers. And now he's double ended that by saying, um, Your girl likes rappers, fill her, fill her, fill her. Oh my god. Okay, the wordplay is top, top draw. This is a fucking good diss, this. Your girl is a king of the dot groupie that be letting rappers fill her. Oh. We got mutual friends, they gave me dirt. These are facts. Your okay. girlfriend ghost writes half your raps on YouTube. The biggest video of mine has more views than. What? I got a minute. Has he been talking to Tom McDonald's friends, did he say? And these are facts, and he's saying Nova writes half of his songs. Is that true? If there are two piece, who cares? Tom McDonald's music is still fucking amazing. But he is pointing out saying that Tom's not a proper rapper if somebody else is writing half of his raps. Okay. <laughs> That's another good punch. <laughs> rappers filler, we got mutual friends. They gave me dirt. These are facts. Right. Your girlfriend ghost writes half your raps on YouTube. The biggest video of mine has okay. more views than all your fucking videos combined. Right. Speaking of YouTube, you claim that I'm irrelevant. I got two million more fucking subscribers than you do. No. You wear women's clothes and Nicki Minaj braids because you gotta <laughs> hide the fact that you secretly got AIDS. You think what? That I'm not paid? You can't say that. You say that when you really, really hate somebody, don't you? And you say, oh, you've got AIDS. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, God, Lethal's right. Man. I mean, he is taking the piss there about the braids. I just, I, I didn't strategically pause that there and take it back. It just happened to be on that picture. But, man, his, his observations, and, uh, I mean, he's doing his, clearly he's doing his research on Tom, because, I mean, he's got about his, like, his frat boy, and he's, he's you know, he's, Talked to some of his. Well, I just picked up the second time round that he uh, he said mutual friends, so they've got friends, you know, that they both know. Obviously, they've been dishing the dirt on him, so you know he's asked around. He's asked around to do this. This. You menage braids, cause you gotta hide the fact that you secretly got AIDS. You think that I'm not paid, silly bitch? I'm a millionaire. You want proof? Meet me at the bank, and I'ma kill you there. No. White on white violence. Damn, it's snowing. You're the fucking rap equivalent of Candace Owens. God, I really? heard you block people on Twitter because they told you Mac Lethal is bigger. Sweet Jesus, you're bitter. What? <laughs> people been telling him, been telling him Mac Lethal is bigger than you. Obviously, clearly Mac Lethal fans. So he's blocking him. So fuck me. He was flexing his muscles about his bank balance as well, but you know, if he's got the money, he's got the money, hasn't he? Black people on Twitter because they told you Mac Lethal is bigger. Sweet Jesus, you're bitter. What's the matter, Lele Pons? Did my lethal injection get stuck in your JJ wrong? No. Oh, what's the matter, Meth Lamore? You need another. Oh, Meth Lamore. Is he comparing him to Macklemore? Oh, I didn't, I didn't, it just, it just, it just stuck him in and he said meth Lamour. But meth Lamour, because Tom used to be um, addicted, an addict, and addicted to drugs and stuff, and you get off it using methadone, don't you? Meth Lamour, that's, that's very clever, that's very clever. She can get stuck in your JJ wrong, <laughs> oh, what's the matter, meth Lamour? Uh -huh. You need another stupid white boy gimmick to move some units out the record store? You're not Whoa. a lyricist, you're not controversial, no one is offended by you, and that really hurts you, bro. You lie okay. about your height, you're not 6'5", you little man, you look like Kid Rock had a What? What's up? He's out tall is Tom? It hurts you, bro. You lie about your height, you're not 6'5", you little... So I'll tell this Tom McDonald <laughs> because I, you know, he, he, he looks, he doesn't look like a small person, but I mean, if he is lying about his height, then obviously, 
Matt Lethal is just basically using anything and anything that he can. He's probably looking for pictures of Tom all over Google and stuff and looking for the, any any little bit of information that he can get to himself just to fire a shot. You know, it doesn't matter. I mean, these these sorts of ones about saying he's not very tall and stuff are just like the the petty, the cheap shots. Um, not not really like like a. Tom would deflect such stuff like that. The stuff like he's talking about Nova and stuff like that, he's going to take personally. Uh, and, you know, they will probably be in the next rap. But, I mean, I mean, he's going all in. You can't... But, I mean, Tom did do the first song. You know what I mean? Tom did this in first. So, you know, you, it's fair game. It's fair fucking game. So, man, you look like Kid Rock had a meth baby with Lil Xan. You look like Lil Pump had a crack baby with Bad Baby. What's the matter, Elsa? Why you acting sad lately? I'm a martial artist. You fake wrestle, bitch. You aren't the man, <laughs> but you do look like Becky Lynch. Oh, uh, I was going to say who's Becky Lynch. Don't know who that is. Tammy McDougfart's real wrestling footage. Oh, God. Where's he dug this up from? <laughs> I know nothing of Tom McDonald's wrestling career. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, let's see what he's got. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> coming to the ring right now, this man is a Canadian who would give anything to be American. <laughs> Standing five foot eight, I mean, uh, six foot five, oh, weighing God. 72 pounds, Tammy McDougfart. <laughs> Oh, fuck off! He's just basically that's 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 clever. That's, no, that, that is clever. The way he just, he's just hang on, the way he just come in saying he's a Canadian who wants to be an American because he addressed that before. Now he's getting his height. He's five foot eight, uh, uh, six foot four. Uh, clever, clever. <laughs> okay. Oh shit! Let's watch this wrestling video. Oh my god, what kind, <laughs> what kind of fucking move is that? Oh what is that? <laughs> oh in my. your diss song, you tried to say that I was gay, right? You're the motherfucker that be dressing up in grey tights So you and other half-naked men can f Oh no, oh no, okay So, um, if Tom knew that footage was out there He has fucking walked straight into a door with that one Because he's, he's got... Max got him banged to rights there because he's he's got that footage of him. He called him a gay man, and then he looks like he's doing something to this guy. You know what I mean? It's something sinister to this guy with a wrestling move, and he's he's worked that into there. So that is that's that's got Tom on the ropes. That that has got Tom on the ropes with these with this disc. Honestly, it's God, man. This guy's very, very clever. I had no idea he was this good. Fucking play fight. You just need an excuse to lay there and take pipe. In America, hog is another word for dick, which is the reason that you have it tatted underneath your lip. Because you love dick, bro. You give enough head. You wear nail polish, motherfucker. Nuff said. Uh, I don't even have to explain that. Oh, my God. I mean, talk about going in depth in research. I mean, how did he? How did he go and look for something to rip the hug on his face? And the fact that it does mean that, you know, very, very. Oh man, I'm crying. <sighs> this guy is funny as well. He's funny with it as well, though, isn't he? Is another word for dick, which is the reason that you have it tatted underneath <laughs> your lip. Cause you love dick, bro. You give enough head. You wear nail polish, motherfucker. Nuff said. <laughs> you ain't skilled, be quiet. You look like Billie Eilish. Did too many pills and got filled with violence and killed her stylist. I heard oh. you diss, bitch. I ain't bust a sweat. You diss ICP, homie. Your girl's a juggalette. You say I'm <laughs> in my birdies like... <laughs> He ICP. Obviously, the insane clown posse. But obviously, when Tom said it, he said that Matt Lethal was the biggest clown on stage, which was a very good shot. But now he's got Nova in again. Obviously, I think that was a set of was it Clown World or something. But I mean, oh, mate, he's going a lot in on Nova, isn't he? I think he knows that that will spark a massive response with the uh, Tom. Because you know he's going to be protective of her more than protective protective of himself. <sighs> God damn! Wow. Like this shit is a bad thing. I'm healthy and I'm rich and I'm living my rap dreams. My kids go to Max? a nice private school. I got a sick fucking house. I own my own pool. How the fuck you gonna try to say I'm having an identity crisis? You're a thirty year old man dressing like this. He's right. He's got the money. He's got the house. He's saying that he's got, a, he's old and he's he's past it. He's got the identity crisis, and then Tom rocks up in a fucking big Hawaiian shirt. 
Fair play. Try to say I'm having an identity crisis. You're a 30 year old man dressing like this. <laughs> I wear normal clothes. I don't need controversy and shock value. I grab the mic and pour my soul. Let this shit be a lesson in how you thirst fame. From here on out, your name is infinitely cursed, man. Cause if okay. you say your last name, you have to say my first name. Bitch, my fucking okay. rap name is in your fucking birth name, Mac. Oh, oh, that was a good mic drop moment back as well. Obviously, putting Mac and McDonald together, saying it's going to bug you infinitely that every time you say your name, you have to say my first name because it's in your birth name. Oh, my God. Talk about shots fired. Oh, my. I think I think Tom's on the ropes on this one. I'm sorry. Um, this guy addressed everything that Tom said to him and did it in such a quirky manner. And, you know, Tom's going to have to come back with something a lot, a lot more... Um, ruthless, I was going to say, because that was absolute. That was brilliant. It was. It was good. And like I say, my first, uh, my first experience with Matt Lethal, he's brilliant. I know I called him a YouTuber and stuff like that, because when I did the research on who he was, it said that he started his record label thing um, on on YouTube. So I said he's a YouTube rapper because that's what I saw him singing. But I mean, he's a little bit more than that, isn't he? He's, uh, he's, he's, wow. Oh, Tom's got some work to do. I cannot wait to check out the last song because I know. Um, so I think somebody told me on the channel that there's no more responses after Tom does the third one. But this, yeah, I think I think Matt Lethal's in the lead after. Th but I mean, I suppose you're at a disadvantage. If you do the disc first, because someone's got something to work with there when they do the second thing. But Matt Lethal, yeah, I dig him. I might have to do some of his songs. So let me know in the comments what sort of songs to do for him. Wow, this was uh, this was a lot of fun. Can't wait to do the Tom McDonald disc back to single white female. Anyway, if you like my videos, then please hit like and subscribe. If you want to support me on Patreon or any of the social medias, and the links are in the description. Thanks for watching. I shall see you on the next one.